joining us tonight. I'm Mark Hamlin. And I'm Jane McCarthy. That man's name is Francis Saijan. He now is facing battery charges. Graham 2's Amanda Rowley has more on what led to his arrest. Link Casino CEO Francis Saijon made no first appearance after posting bond early this morning, but he will return to Kootenai County Court on December 7th for his misdemeanor battery charge. Court documents say Francis Saijon got into an argument with his brother while they were out for drinks in Spokane. That's when court docs say Saijon said he would bring some guys to his brother's house. Saijon's brother later returned to his home in Post Falls. He told police he saw a car pull up and Saijon getting out of the car. Then, when the victim stepped outside, court docs say he was hit by two guys. That's when the victim's wife called police and reported a group of men beat up her husband and took off in a burgundy Cadillac. She identified Saijon and his son, but couldn't identify the third male suspect. Saijon's brother suffered four cuts on his face and cuts to both of his ears. Court docs say Post Falls Police eventually found a vehicle matching the description and arrested Saijon. Police say Saijon had fresh blood on his face and the side of his face was swollen. Saijon told police he was in a tangle. Police searched Saijon for any weapons and none were found. Court docs also identified Saijon's son being with him at the time of the fight. He is now in juvenile custody and charged with battery as well. The spokesperson for the Coeur d'Alene tribe said they will not make any comment or provide a statement regarding their employees or tribe members. And I also contacted Sai John's sister-in-law who witnessed this incident and she declined to comment. Reporting from the Kootenai County Courthouse, Amanda Rowley, Creme 2 News.